The Old Woman and the Hind Late one evening, a man was walking home over the hills. He had a long way to go, and clearly was not going to reach his house that night, so he looked about for a place to sleep. There was a patch of woodland in a glen below him, and soon he had dropped down into the shelter of the trees. A few minutes later, he came to the edge of a clearing. Summery boughs hung low, and the bracken was thick. The night was so fine that he was glad to make his bed out of doors. He pulled himself a mattress of dry bracken and lay back, looking up for the leaves at the stars. It was early when he woke. Sitting up to stretch, he discovered that he was not alone. A little way off in the trees, an old woman was standing beside a beautiful hind, stroking its flank. Then she crouched down and began to milk it into a small pail. The man sank low into the bracken and watched. When she was finished, she straightened up, but as she stood, a twist of blue wool with something glittering in it fell from her pocket to the ground, and before she could pick it up, the hind had lowered its beautiful head and eaten it. The old woman was very angry, and shouted at the beast in Gaelic that that day would be shot by Lord Ray as punishment. When she had gone, the man rose very slowly to his feet. The hind started when it saw him, and in a few leaps had vanished among the trees. He continued his journey, wondering very much. A few days afterwards he could contain his curiosity no longer, and sent his son on horseback to inquire of the Lord Ray's keeper whether, in fact, his lordship had killed the hind on that day. The boy was back within a few hours with his answer. Lord Ray had indeed shot a hind, and when the animal was disembowelled, a twist of blue wool with a strange silver medallion attached to it was found in its stomach. And that was a tale of the old woman and the hind.